Gold refining became one of Ghana's economic pillars, as Ghana is one of the top 10 countries in gold reserve in the world. Among six foreign companies and one local-based company made by Eurojet Group headquartered in Egypt that were licensed to refine and export gold in Ghana, only the Gold Coast refinery has the booming success. The gold draw will be transmitted to the GCR Ghana from gold mines of West African states such as Mali, Guinea, Burkina Faso, Niger, Sierra Leone, and Ivory Coast. For security and business reasons, strategically located within the premises of Katuka International Airport, a fully secured refinery, advised by the security specialist to be done as follows. 10 guard towers, electrified fences, outer premises of visitors parking, secured premises of the factory, which contains the gold reception and the VIP entrance, the future extension of the refinery, jewelry design and manufacturing. Non-refined gold arrives top-notch in technology armored vehicles, passing two security checks to the gold reception. Two heavily secured shutter doors to ensure the safe transfer of gold. The first floor of the refinery overlooks the production floor. The production line is split into two lines. The chemical production, which is capable of reaching purity levels of 999.9 .9, over 1000 of purity fine gold. The electrolytic production for gold, for reaching 999.9 .9 over 1000 of pure fine gold, besides treating other precious metals like platinum and palladium. Gold is refined according to international standard of the bullion delivery, such as London Bullion Market Association standards. Final product purity is 999.9 .9 over 1000. 290 ton volts with total capacity of 180 ton fine gold exists. 40 surveillance cameras outside and 24 inside. Substation of 1.4 megawatts to supply electricity for two weeks emergency. Automatic transfer switch. Automatic voltage regulator. Water tanks to supply water for two weeks emergency. LPG tank for the necessary functions. Several tanks for the chemical supply. The waste treatment is in accordance with the international norms and accepted levels for environmental protection. A complete separate and secured VIP entrance and parking ready for VIP visits on location with a separate entrance. The production capacity is up to 600 kilograms per a single shift of 8 hours per day and around 180 tons per year. Such production capacity and investments evaluated of 110 million US dollars. Gold Coast Refinery in Ghana is meant to serve all the West Africa region and others worldwide. The Gold Coast Refinery in Ghana, the future of gold refining industry in Africa.